type of rhythm. Well, NAU doesn't have a whole lot of momentum right now as Pablo goes up and a nice shot. That's a tough one right there. That was we talk about Smith is scoring and then right there, a nice interior pass. Back to back, good looks from each team. Lucero to Sinajini to the inside, and that's a brand new play that NAU has been working on in practice right there. You saw the ball screen. Gets Takes the screen the opposite direction, and now she backs out, gets the ball here. I think that's a two-point shot, and it certainly is. Sinajini puts that one down right now. Sinajini liked the shot that she saw and knocks it down. That's five points in the last two possessions for Tate. And those numbers have bumped up and gotten even better in conference play. A sweet move by Lucero, and you see her improvise so often, and that's her. McDavis goes under the basket, tries for a crazy reverse layup, and she gets it to go. <laughs> That's talent right there. And as for NAU, they'd like to get going from beyond the arc, but Lucera spots up the pull-up jumper. Only one of them was a three. Lee Hughes, she'll take the mid-range jumper this time, and NAU putting that area of the floor to the test and successfully doing so there. Uh, McDavis should have cut down to the paint there, but she'll take the three well, and say, why not cut and get a three-pointer? Maybe she'll say, Cordero, I know. <laughs> Make intelligent passes, and another one there knocked up. <laughs> Nice and physical by Carroll, and that one from way downtown. Sinajini knocks it down. Deep three there by Sinajini. In the second half. And Olivia, too, with answers back with a, with a mid range jump. Nice look in the paint there for Pablo. And there's the hard cut that Lori Payne is looking for. Leo coming from Lucero. A nice trailing defense by Clark. Fadeaway shot. Taking advantage of it, Clark slouched off. Nice play there by Papro to get to the interior. And we're talking a lot lately. Wide open, Sinajini, she'll have it. Easy buckets for her. Winning streak as we talk about them, 10 and three in conference. The three ball goes up right away and gets knocked down. That's Tiana Clark putting that one down. Oh, yeah. They certainly do, and they need other people from the bench to step up. That was another three coming in for Tiara. <laughs> so far for the Bears, a nice pass, but a good defensive play there. Getting into the paint was Caprice Boston, Calais Pap. <laughs> Slow pass rolls out. Fakes going in, the step back for Williams, a nice shot right there. You know, sometimes she can get hot and hit those, but now is not the time. There's another three shot from Williams. She's the one heating up. Savannah Scott is kind of like that, that um, what do you want to call it, uh, partner in crime for her. Yeah, they feed off of each other's energy, sort of her and a lot of these Northern Colorado players, though. There's a new face checking in, taking the three shot. That's Kramer. Um, offensively, you know, they just kind of get her going as well. A nice play leading scorer for NAU in this one with six points. Orndoff, now they like the outside shot. They're very successful from beyond the arc. Seven for 16 and throwing up another one. Hintz goes down for the Bears. A sweet pass. A little bit of saucer action right there. And Williams on fire tonight. And what they do is, is Coach Payne calls out a play and they go for it, and they get a certain amount of points as Smith is on fire right now, knocks down another shot. High percentage shots are the best kind of shots. And Smith, again, mid-range jumper, she's on fire. She's feeling it right now. Not looking like the same team tonight as Smith. Oh, she's been red hot so far in the second half and continues the trend, puts down another three. And I can do better, that's for sure, and an easy bucket down there again for Smith. She missed her first six. The hops, but then you always have that what if, and Smith with it, with, it looks easy. Four contact goes for the lane, a couple of quick passes, and another three shot on fire right now. Is a couple of missed opportunities back to back, another turnover, and it continues for NAU. Cut into the basket, uncontested, unmarked right there, yet to succeed. Nice pass. Ledger Walker gets it out to Chapman and mark up.